Well, there is nothing quite like this occasion. Welcome to the UEFA Champions League final. The best two teams in Europe this season preparing to go head-to-head -head for the crown. This is Derek Ray in the commentary position and I'm joined as always on these big occasions by the former Arsenal and England defender Lee Dixon. It is Liverpool against Atletico Madrid. Well, I'm so excited for everybody, the fans, everybody connected to both clubs, but it's the players I'm so excited for. I've never actually played in the Champions League final, but played in other finals. I know what they're feeling. We can see the nerves already starting to jangle. How do you cope with those nerves, Derek? How do you settle yourself down before what's going to become probably the biggest game of your career? one situation well high fives all round for the goalkeeper absolutely fantastic Henderson Fabinho now Thiago distributing shrewdly Mane Liverpool up on the scoring in the Champions League final. Oh, it's a brilliant moment. Just look at the fans, Derek. Look at the fans. Well, we see it again here. It's a peach of a through ball. And then through on goal, you never really had any doubt he was going to slot that away. Good finish. Well, the coach can feel this game slipping away, I'm sure. Might need a plan B. Salah. Roberto Firmino. Opportunity it is. And there it is! A two-goal cushion now. And just look at these fans. The trophy coming there. Surely! Well, here it is again. It's all about the pace in transition. It was so quick to get out from the back, and he takes full advantage of the time he's given. It's an accomplished finish, too. Well, enjoy the good days as a coach. It could be a roller coaster ride, I can tell you that. Well, as the stats show you, Atletico enjoying the bulk of possession here, but it's just whether they can convert that possession into clear cut chances. You sense they need to pick up the pace a little, start utilising the wide areas more. The back line's doing a decent job. Hopefully, the forwards could put one back here. The save was a good one. Atletico's corner. And now the delivery. Carrasco. Correa. Llorente. And they could get one back here. Oh, he saved it well. And the referee has given them a corner. Well, Derek, I feel for him. I really do. It's just not happening in front of goal for his team today. Played into the centre of the box. Just unable to take advantage of that developing situation. Saul, 
Llorente. Carrasco! And that, a piece of goalkeeping you're going to see again and again and again. How about this? England's most successful European club have done it again. Liverpool, the winners of the Champions League. Well, some might say back to where they belong. An absolutely brilliant night. Capped off with winning the trophy. Commiserations for their opposition, but at the moment it's all about celebration for those boys. Yeah, that is precisely what they intend to do, Lee. Celebrate long into the evening. Liverpool the victors. And now, as a player, and in this case, as a Liverpool player, you've got to prepare yourself for the trophy lift. Well, yeah, this is where you want to be the captain. Sometimes it's a hindrance because everybody's looking at you for a bit of inspiration. But you get to do this. You get to pick up this magnificent trophy and celebrate with your teammates Liverpool this year have painted Europe red it's official now the kings of European club football Liverpool well certainly the red half of Liverpool and Merseyside will be celebrating tonight not so sure about the Everton fans but even they might celebrate a little bit Oh, this is the moment I love, sharing it with the fans. The ticker tape's coming down, the family's in the stand, giving them all a wave. Well, they've travelled all over Europe watching this team. Now they get to share in this moment. Fantastic. Well, it took fire as well as ice on the pitch. Well, they've come together in this competition as a team and they're celebrating together now, fully deserved. And you are looking at the best club side in Europe. 